everybody, welcome to the homestead. What we're going to do today is talk about wind power. You know, if you've been watching our videos for any length of time, that we have solar panels here on the homestead. And those solar panels help us with our energy needs. We use those solar panels to uh, provide a lot of power for our greenhouse and for our office. Uh, uh, it's uh, a trailer that we've converted to an office, and that office helps us charge our laptops and stay connected to you through the internet. Well, what we're going to do today and over the next week or so is add a couple of wind turbines to our, sol our, to our energy production with those solar panels. And what we're going to do, what we're going to do is make a couple different videos. The first video is going to be about the Primus Air 40. This is going to be the first wind turbine that we install here on the homestead. We have another wind turbine that I'm going to do another video about here shortly. But first, we're going to kick it off with this one. This is the Primus Air 40. It is a 24 volt uh, wind turbine. And we're going to do an unboxing today. We're going to do an assembly today. And we're just going to talk about some of the benefits of having this particular wind turbine and how we're going to go about setting it up. And then we're going to do a, a number of other videos going forward from here on out on our wind power and uh, show you how everything's hooked up and show you how you can do this too and so that if you want to go down this road of having your own wind power you can see how we've done it and that may give you a better idea of how you can do it as well. Alright, so stick with us. Okay, so here is the wind turbine. It looks pretty amazing. It's definitely very heavy, hefty, and solidly built. Um, the wings seem pretty uh, flexible, but yet strong. Um, so um, looking forward, we're gonna go ahead and put this thing together and then see what it looks like once it's all assembled. Okay, so we're done. Uh, it puts together pretty easy. It's not a lot, it doesn't take any brain surgery to put this thing together. The instructions were very simple to follow, very easy. And so this thing is now together. It is ready to go up on the tower. Uh, we have a, all, the, all the stuff we need to put a tower up. Um, we're gonna be putting that up later this week. And so uh, I wanted to get, kind of go through this and share with you one of the reasons why I decided on this model. This model, by the way, is available through one of our advertisers, readymaderesources.com. You can see the link right there on the screen, or you can find it in the description of the video below. Uh, but readymaderesources.com is one of our advertisers, and they offer a whole variety of alternative energy systems that you can uh, scroll through on their website and look through. And it's all divided into categories and subcategories, so you should pretty much be able to find easily whatever you need. Uh, this was one of the offerings that they that they have on their website. It is Primus, the Air 40. And uh, I looked at the specs on this model and I really thought it would probably fit best with what we have here on the homestead, knowing that we're doing solar uh, already and that, that this paired together with the solar uh, would help give us uh, just a better um, energy production uh, year round. But primarily in the winter time. You see, where we are right now, we are on top of a 24, basically a 2400 foot mountain and we get a lot of wind uh, during the winter time. If you look on the US wind map, uh, especially in the winter time, this wind map will show you where you are and what kind of wind you can expect during the winter time. And where we are, uh, we get a lot of wind. We can get winds uh, on average of 10 to 15 miles an hour every day. Uh, on some days it's higher, up to 30 miles an hour or so, maybe even a little more. And some days it's slower, five to six miles an hour. And some days there's not wind at all. But for the most part, during the winter time, we have a good constant breeze that goes over the homestead. And that's why I thought this would work out pretty well for us. And um, this has a lot of good benefits. Uh, number one, you don't need a charge controller with it. Everything is 
uh, built into the wind turbine. It has a microprocessor, it's microprocessor controlled on the inside, and so the regulator uh, does all the work for you, and, and it's uh, um, what's called a PMA, um, a type of alternator, uh, that produces energy with rare earth magnets, and uh, it sets all, all you need to do is directly connect it to your batteries. And so it's a very simple plug and play system for the most part, and uh, you can have, you don't even need a dump load uh, for this wind turbine. A lot of wind turbines you definitely need a dump load and our other wind turbine that we're going to be doing another video on here shortly is going to have a dump load attached to it. Uh, but for this model, this particular model, you don't need a dump load. And so when I talked to the rep on the phone uh, about this model at Primus, uh, they were very informative. They have a whole series of videos and information on their website that help you go through um, you know, what you need to know when you purchase uh, this type of, of wind turbine. And like I said, uh, the Air 40 just looks like, reading by reading the specs, is going to work out really well for us here on the homestead. Again, you don't need a dump load, you don't need a charge controller, everything is built in, this plugs and plays right on the battery bank, and uh, you can just kind of monitor with, your char with the charge controller that we have already hooked up to the solar panels, you know, where the battery bank is sitting at. Of course, you will need to add a fuse, uh, it's always good to have a fuse, you'll need to add a ground rod. You'll need to add a stop switch, and if you would like, you can maybe have an analog uh, uh, amp meter uh, attached to this to, uh, to see kind of what, what kind of current you're getting uh, from the turbine at any given time. But for the most part, it's plug and play, very simple, and the instructions that come with the system are very easy to follow. So anyway, I, I've just enjoyed uh, going ahead the process of putting this together, I would highly recommend it so far. We're going to keep you up to date with further videos on this turbine and the other turbine that we're going to install and just give you an idea and review over the course of time, over the course of this winter, how it's all working out. So I hope you'll stick with our channel. Uh, check us out on Facebook. If you haven't gone to Facebook yet, like our Facebook channel and uh, tell others if you guys are in, if any you know anybody else who's interested in wind turbines or wind power share this video with them and you can tell them that we got this from our uh, one of our advertisers readymaderesources.com we really appreciate them and all of our advertisers who are on our website go ahead and visit their website and see what all they have to offer you all right we'll see you next time on the homestead if you enjoyed this video please click the thumbs up button below the video it really makes creating these videos worthwhile if you want to make sure to never miss a new video, be sure to click the subscribe button. Now you can get your homesteading questions answered. Visit us at our contact page on anamericanhomestead.com and send us your questions. Maybe we'll pick your question for a future video or article on our website.